Japan yeah. has a lot of crazy stuff. They're pretty sure that their suicide rate is really high too. Because of their work culture. Yeah, like it's you get the benefit of the nap, but like you're expected to work like crazy. And you you don't really get uh, high pay a nap either. Here is just fine. Also, but this <laughs> yeah. is I mean we're bashing them a lot, but there's also another pro. I saw it on in the internet. It's kind of related, but not related. It's one of their perks, and I guess for it's a perk for men. They say that for guys, women there do not see a man paying a hooker as cheating. Oh, I did see that. What? Yeah, because to them, marriage is purely is meant for children. Yeah, I guess. And they're saying that they would rather a man, or women there say they would rather a man pay for a hooker, a hooker, a hookup, whatever. Because it's not, there's no emotion behind it. It's just like, oh, he's getting it out of the way, they're done. Versus like if he's cheating on them emotionally. I'm not saying that's right, okay? I, I don't yeah. agree with that, but I'm just saying that's how Japanese. That's, yeah. that's a very interesting like way of thinking. It's like, it's like a transaction. It's, it's a, like transaction. Yeah. a transaction. It's a transaction and there's no feelings involved. Yeah. So they were like, we would, they would rather have that than them go out and cheat on them with like another woman they actually have feelings for. What if they like catch feelings for the hooker though? Well, then that dude's, that dude's dumb. <laughs> I don't know, man. That... Well, how would you guys right? feel about like that? Like regular customer? What's your, what's, your, what's your belief on that? What's your view on hookers in general? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> hookers. Hookers? Say, say you were dating somebody and you yeah. had, like uh, your man goes to Vegas, right? Is right. Vegas known for like that those ty- for those type of people? They have escorts yes. in Vegas. Escorts? They have yeah. escorts okay. in escorts, Vegas. Yes. All right. So let's say your man goes to a bachelor party in Vegas and then smashes a um, an escort. Do you, are you like does that constitute as cheating? I mean, do I get to smash a male escort too? <laughs> hey, that that uh, that aside, that aside, I'm asking you. Like, say he comes back, it was, "Hey, oh babe, I, I I gotta confess something. I smashed a hooker. Like, I was whatever for whatever whatever reason. How are you reacting? Like, are you saying that that's cheating? I feel like it would be cheating. Yeah. Okay, Viv, what's your opinion? I don't know. That's tough. It is really tough. I would say like no, but in a way I was just like, <laughs> no. like I don't I don't want to know. Like don't tell me. That tells me you're okay with it, but just like out of sight, out of mind. I wouldn't be okay with it, but okay, but like take take this out of the context. Like what if she like, wasn't like an escort or a hooker and he just If it was for like a bachelor party, I feel like there would have to be like a discussion or something. And then I don't I don't know that this is a wild. Your fit is wild right oh now. Oh my! She's like, she's like, yes, yeah. but no, but yes. Oh my! Like yes, Lord. but I'll kill him. <laughs> yeah, yes, but I'll kill him. So okay, so like you're okay with it, but you're like, I'm gonna fuck you up when you get back. Yeah, or she could just like fuck another man in front of him, and then be like, this is my revenge. Nope. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Dang. I just, would you say that I get a hall pass for a weekend? No, I personally wouldn't do that. I, I don't know. I'm, I feel like it's just like a hooker. She's been many job. places. <laughs> she's like, she better be a darn, yeah. god dang it. <laughs> yeah. We, oh, yeah. Like, if he, like, smashed, like, a hooker, but she wasn't, like, bad, bad, like, I would be upset. Like, I'd be like, you... You risk it all for that? Yeah, you risk it all for that? <laughs> Actually, yeah, I would be a little upset if... My man did do something like that. Okay. Yeah. I'm about to say. I have another question. All right. I just thought about it. Okay. <laughs> say you go to um, your man. Let's, we'll keep on the top of it. Say bachelor parties. Okay. Say your man goes to a bachelor party and they go to New York. Okay. There's a lot of celebrities in New York, right? He goes to the club. What is that? And what if he meets like a fine like celebrity? Uh, we'll say who's a, he's who's, a beautiful. Who plays Barbie? Huh? Plays Margot Robbie. Who's Margot? Uh, what, okay, the girl who plays Bar- Barbie. Sure, we'll say her. I don't know who it is, but we'll say her. She's a fine ass woman. Okay. She's fine. And then your man smashes. I mean, how would you feel about that? Say you get a baby. I came back and said, "Dude, I just smashed a a uh, a, a uh, movie star or celebrity or whoever or Doja Cat." No. Your, your man goes to New York and smashes Doja Cat. I'm sorry, Doja Cat. I'm using you, but whatever. <laughs> right? How no, would you feel about that, huh? Doja Cat? Ashley? I'd be like, yeah. why didn't you call me up? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's not fair. I mean, I'd be upset, but I kind of be like, your mom man pulls that. Yeah, I'd be like, oh, I'll, I'll probably let it slide. Yeah, I'd be like, did you get the bag too? 
Oh my god. So you're okay with that? They're smashing like a because it's like a once in a lifetime thing. Yeah. Okay. I'd be I'd be so upset. My future man's gonna watch this and hold it against me. Cat. <laughs> <laughs> you said it was okay that I smashed Doja Cat. 